Subscribers and fans, welcome back. Iceman here. And there's been some official information regarding Godzilla King of Monsters. And I'm talking about Rodan, Mothra, and King Ghidorah. Now, I've talked to some of these in the previous videos. But check this out. This was in 1991, according to Monarch. It claims that a covert Monarch team establishes a quarantine zone around the island's dormant volcano under the guise of environmental research, quote-unquote. Over the coming years, what began as a small scientific outpost will expand to become a full containment facility around the mouth of the volcano. Now that is spooky, but there's more to it. There's something about Mothra on here as well. If only I could get this damn page to... <laughs> Shit! Shit! The page didn't load. I'm going to go back. Shit! Okay, here it is. Excuse me. Okay, there's more about uh, Mothra coming up. Now check this out. Here it is. Check this out. This was in 2009. It's titled Temple of the Moth. It says, uh, Mythographic studies of Chinese temples leads monarch to the high altitude jungles of the something province. Can't quite read it. Dr. Emma Russell and her team follow a mysterious bioacoustic signature to a previously undiscovered megalithic temple within which lies a gigantic cocoon. A quickening heartbeat is detected inside. Damn, that is awesome. So probably some ancient temple, perhaps forerunners of the universe and such, or of Earth, had something to do with this some time ago. Maybe preparing these monstrous kaiju to battle what might come. And in this case, King Ghidorah. And on that note, in 2016, it's titled Monster Zero. It claims that when monarch discover an extraordinary superspecies sealed beneath the Antarctic ice sheet, Dr. Vivine Graham leads the effort to build a covert containment and research facility around the dormant creature. Her classified field notes contain a mysterious footnote. Quote, the devil has three heads. Some very interesting material we have to work with here. And I wonder what else they might reveal. They're doing a damn good job at getting us excited for the film. But I find that interesting how Mothra is in a temple and the heartbeat is quickening. What do you guys think about this current setup? and where these kaiju seem to be located currently. And how do you think they're going to awaken? Let me know in the comments section below. And like this damn video if you haven't yet. More ice to come.